Saturday, June 19th, and today's the day. Um, just waiting for my partner here to pick me up and take us over to Bass Pro Shop in Vaughan. Uh, we've got a couple last minute things I want to pick up for the trip next weekend. Um, it's now turned into a two day camp. We were going to do Saturday and check out Sunday, but we couldn't pass up a great deal. So we're doing check in Friday evening, um, staying Friday evening, staying Saturday evening, and checking out Saturday morning. Um, so yeah, today we're heading over to Bass Pro. Um, I'd like to get myself a sleeping pad. Um, I purchased a sleeping pillow, a uh, blow-up ultralight pillow last night off Amazon. So I don't need a pillow. Um, I need a sleeping pad, perhaps a wool blanket. And um, I like to get a quick set or titanium spork or something like that. But it's Bass Pro Shop, so who knows what I'm going to walk in there with. Um, maybe even some hiking shoes. Um, I'd like to get a pair of shoes that I'm not afraid of beating the crap out of. Um, don't know what I'm going to walk out of there with, but uh, hopefully not uh, breaking the bank and putting myself $1,000 in, into debt. Um, either way, yeah, he's going to be here within the next five minutes or so, so I will keep you guys updated. Stay tuned. Here we go. picking me up and uh, he said he'll be here in about eight minutes so yeah just gonna go down and wait for him um, then we're gonna head across 401 to highway 400 head north until we hit Bass Pro Mill Lane and then uh, yeah I don't know if I'll record from my house to there but um, I'll see you guys at one point, maybe a little short video on the way or when we get there, but see you soon. Okay guys, we're just getting off the highway now. Um, Bass Pro Shop is just to the right of us. I'm here with Puria. He just picked me up at my house. Um, we're going to be at Bass Pro in about two minutes. You have to get in this lane. Um, oh yeah, you can. Sorry. Yeah. So yeah, uh, as soon as we walk into Bass Pro Shop, I'll start showing you guys some of the stuff that I'm thinking of buying. Stay tuned. Okay, we just got here. There it is over there. Bass Pro Shop in Vaughn Mills, just north of Toronto. Walking in now, getting last minute stuff before our camp trip next weekend. Whew, it's hot. People don't know how to drive. But that's okay. Yeah, like one of those things uh, they're going to yeah. pick us up in yeah. over there. That's awesome. Okay, guys, I'll show you once we get inside. All right, so I'm just walking up to the camping section here. I don't even know exactly what I want yet. Uh, there's a couple things. Um... You know that I'm thinking of, but uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see what I what do we got here? Compression set. I could use like a wool blanket of some sort if there's any on sale. This stuff's expensive, man. Holy shit! This is fifty nine bucks. <clears throat> hmm. There's got to be some cheaper stuff. Okay, guys, so we've been walking around and uh, I was trying to find a sleeping pad to get. All the sleeping pads here are like $150 Canadian. Like, that's crazy. But I ended up finding this um, Ascend sleeping pad for 80 bucks. And you know what? That's, that's all I need. And I think it's going to do the trip. Um, I also got myself a life straw, nice OD green, so that's going to work out awesome. And uh, Puri is over there holding a pair of hiking boots that I got for $49 on sale. And those are going to work awesome too. So we're just doing a final trip around looking at some of the guns. 
some of the knives and uh yeah then i think i'm gonna head over to canadian tire or walmart and see if i can find a blanket for on top or underneath my pad for when we're camping all right guys stay tuned yeah so we're just doing a final walk around now um i don't know i might want a shirt or maybe a fishing shirt of some sort i don't know Yeah, it's some nice stuff, that's for sure. Really nice stuff. I love this jacket. It's not jacket season though. It's also $400, so no thanks. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna head over to the fishing section because I need some line and some lures. If anybody knows me, they know I'm a Panther Martin freak. That's my stuff, baby. I love it. That's where I catch all my trout with. So yeah, I'll check in when I'm over at the fishing section. Okay guys, so we just left Bass Pro Shop after me being totally physically taken advantage of. Got to the cash register and it was like $300 for like five little things. So yeah, some of that went back. Uh, got some new hiking boots. Got um, new blow up sleeping pad, couple shirts. Um, yeah, that's about it. Um, we're heading over to Canadian Tire now because I want to get a sleeping bag for uh, the sleeping pad to go inside of. And then yeah, other than that, it's basically just food for the weekend. So I'll be right back as soon as we get over to Canadian Tire. All right, guys. So basically the trip's over. Um, I got everything I need um, aside from like one or two small things. Um, so yeah, I'll just go through what I got today and um, then that'll be it for this video. And then the next time you see me will be Friday when we leave for the trip or unless something happens throughout the week but uh yeah here you go so first off first item i got was this outbound brand it's a one pound light sleeping bag this will go over my sleeping pad um i didn't need anything spectacular it's summer it's gonna be hot this is literally just something to protect the sleeping pad underneath and on top um speaking of sleeping pads i showed you guys earlier I ended up getting this Ascend brand sleeping pad. It packs down to about the size of a can of Coke. Um, looks really good. I think it'll do pretty damn good for what I need it for. Um, yeah, I'm excited to use that. Well, what else do I got here? Um, I picked up some Muscal bug spray because North Ontario you know damn well it's gonna be buggy. I picked up these large rat traps. The reason I picked up these traps is because I've used them before to catch squirrel. And secondly, my good buddy, well, I call him my buddy because I watch him. Wood Beardsman showed me a great way, great way, sorry, to catch squirrels. Uh, what you do is nail these to the tree and bait them squirrel comes down the tree and has to bite the whatever feed that you've put on the trap trap closes on the squirrel and the squirrel's left there dangling for you to swing by and pick up so these will be set on the trip if we catch something i will be cooking it um and then yeah other than that i basically just got some bass pro shop shirts um nothing special so yeah, that's really basically everything I got on this trip. So other than that guys, tune in on Friday when we hit the road and head towards Campbellville. I'm probably going to be heading out of here around 5 or 6 o'clock on Friday and getting there around 6 or 7 and setting up camp. And I will be recording everything on the GoPro and my cell phone for other stuff that I do so make sure to follow and make sure to like and share subscribe 
follow me on Instagram at great underscore white underscore bushcraft. And I will see you guys Friday for the first voyage. Have a good week, guys. Bye.